Stan stared at the rabbit in shock. Was he going crazy or did it just talk to him? You need to kill Alice before she kills you. The brown and white rabbit said to him again before it turned around and hopped into the bushes and out of sight. This development worried Stan. If animals were talking to him again, that meant one of two possibilities. The first is that whatever dormant gene that caused his father's schizophrenia had finally manifested in him, or his current balance of medication wasn't working like it was supposed to. Either way, it meant that Stan needed to get to his psychiatrist as soon as possible. On his way back to work from his lunch break, while wondering how he was going to convince his boss to give him time off tomorrow, a large black crow landed on the sidewalk in front of him. Alice is going to kill you, it said to him. Fuck off, bird. Stan kicked his leg out at the crow, which definitely dodged it and landed on the awning to the sandwich shop he was walking past. Watch out, it said to him. It didn't leave its perch on the awning, but just stared at him with his inky black eyes. Stan was glad the ominous crow didn't follow him down the street towards his office. This feeling didn't last, as when he turned around the corner, he saw a line of ants on the sidewalk in front of him that spelled out the words, watch out. Stupid ants, he said as he stepped around them. Stan didn't see or hear anything else until he was on his way home and almost ran down a deer that decided to hop into the middle of a road. Don't go home, Alice is going to kill you the deer said before walking back into the tree line. <sighs> Stan sighed and continued his trek home. Thankfully, no other animals with the dangerous warnings blocked his path before he reached his front door. Hey Al, I'm home, Stan said as soon as he stepped inside the front door. Alice popped her head around the kitchen entrance. Hey, how was work? Okay, I guess. Do you have Dr. Kaepernick's number? I don't have it in my phone. What's wrong? Alice asked from the kitchen. Stan set down his briefcase and stepped into the kitchen to find Alice slicing vegetables on the counter. I think the new meds aren't working. I'm having hallucinations again. Alice turned and looked at him worryingly. I'm sorry, hun, are you okay? Yeah, I kept hearing the animals again. They kept saying you were gonna kill me. <laughs> Ridiculous, right? <sighs> Alice said. I knew I shouldn't have told that rabbit. How did you know? I... <coughs> Was the only thing Stan managed to get out before Alice turned around and slashed his throat with the knife she had been holding.